everybody, Belinda here from Horror Tree, back again with another week of my Horror Tree Weekly Roundup. And firstly, let me say from all of us at Horror Tree, we hope you had a fantastic Christmas and New Year. And hopefully Santa was good to you and you ate, drank and were merry. And secondly, I have a bit of a mixed bag for you guys today. So I've got stuff for people who have novellas or novels in the works, for poets and for us authors. So let's get started. Okay, first up is Weird Little Worlds. Now these guys are looking for novels and novella submissions. So the theme is speculative fiction. They want sci-fi, fantasy, horror, supernatural, steampunk, alternate alternate history, non-fiction adventure, and survival stories. They are interested in acquiring true stories of adventure and intrigue, and they are also looking to publish non-fiction adventure novels that include true, true stories of survival, high stakes, or dangerous careers, or incredible in events featuring real-life heroes. Um, I couldn't I couldn't seem to find a word count on their website um, and payment. Now this is negotiable, but their website states that just being exposed or exposure is not a viable currency for them. And the submissions close on the 28th of Feb, 2023. Okay, moving on to Planet Scum, and that is Scum with two Ms, issue 17. These guys are after speculative fiction, weird fiction, slipstream, hard sci-fi, soft sci-fi, sci-fi that melts in your mouth brain, but not in your hand brain. Um, they are after stories or collections of flash fiction of no more than 5,000 words. No reprints or multiple subs. Payment is six cents per word and the submissions close on the 21st of Feb, 2023. Okay, moving on to Eye to the Telescope, issue 48, Fungi. So the theme for this is fungi. Mushrooms, mold, or other fungi are organisms that live all around us, yet for the longest time they have eluded classification. They can offer sustenance and ensure survival or, or cause a slow poison death. These guys are particularly interested in cli-fi, body horror, and fabulism from marginalized voices. They're after poems of between one to three unpublished poems in English. They are paying US four cents per word rounded to the nearest dollar. So minimum payment will be $4, max will be $25. Submissions close on the 15th of March, 2023. And last, but certainly not least, is A Coop of Owls. These guys are after stories that you've poured your soul into, your heart, your soul, your everything into a story, but you haven't been able to find the right home for it. They're looking for stories that make them feel something, warmth, love, melancholy, rage. They want it all. They want all the feels. Um, they are after drabbles and flash fiction, after short stories, and for Drabbles and Flash Fiction, they are paying five pounds. Short stories of up to 4,000 words, they're paying 10 pounds. And for short stories of between 4,001 to 8,000 words, they are paying 15 pounds. The submission window opens on the 1st of March, 2023, and closes on the 31st of March, 2023. Um, just a note for this one, guys, they, are, they only publish creators from underrepresented underrepresented and or marginalized backgrounds and or communities. So if you consider yourself part of this, you are welcome to submit. And that's it. Another awesome week of amazing submission calls, some really fantastic opportunities for you guys to, to get your work out there. So if any of these do appeal to you, any of these calls do appeal to you, all the information you need is up on the Horror Tree website. Please get on there, check it out and all the best of luck to you if you are going to submit something. And if you are liking these videos, we'd love to hear from you. Hit us, hit like, hit comment, hit share, hit subscribe. Send us some feedback if you so want to. We would love to hear from you. So until the next time, guys, happy new year and we will see you soon. Thank you for watching and stay safe, stay cool and stay spooky. See you later.